We got one of our sisters here is going to talk about how some of these females today was actually raised by side chicks. Let's review it. I got on one lash. I got rained on. But hear me out. Y'all was always saying, pick me, pick me. But I could tell who was raised by side bitches. Let's really talk about this. A lot of you women were raised by who were side bitches. So a lot of the shit that y'all think is okay or think is cool, y'all seen y'all mama do. But you don't know your mama or your grandma was a side bitch, So you think it's cool. Like, let me elaborate. You calling me a pick me because I spoke on some shit that y'all bitches know is true. But because I'm a woman and I said it and I'm supposed to have like, I guess it's woman code. Y'all got a problem? I don't even like you. Bitch. I don't give a fuck if I'm a woman. I don't. <laughs> but you know, let me tell y'all something. I've, I've, I've seen a lot of women say that, that they don't like these females today. They really don't like talking to them much and say, because they get on their nerves. I've heard that quite a few times. I, it, it's, it's funny to hear that, but when they explain it, say, nah, I say, listen, I'd rather have talked to guys like just as a friend. I, I don't even want to deal with some of these women because they caddy, they do this, they do that. I can't stand us. Yeah, that's, I thought I would think that's funny. Like y'all. And I'm going to tell you why I don't like y'all. I don't like y'all because of shit like this. Y'all never honest with y'all for yourself. That's why a lot of the shit y'all go through, a lot of the problems y'all have, and a lot of the emotional support that y'all need is because of y'all. Because y'all don't be honest with yourselves. Literally. And y'all ain't done nothing but prove my point. And then y'all always talk about, pick me, pick me. Yo mama wasn't picked. That's why you think the way that you do. You've never had a real male figure in your life to really be real with you and tell you how men really think. Y'all. Yeah. Yeah. Because a lot. Because you got to think about it. The side chicks do get pregnant too. And the side chick mentality, do you think they don't pass that down to, to their daughters? Because all the child see is, 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 is uh, being the side chick all the time. And the guy comes, the husband of, of another a woman coming in and out of the house, or this guy with a, with a girlfriend coming in and out of the house. And they thinking that kind of lifestyle is normal. And they mom like, hey, look, you know, you need to get money. You need to do this and do that. They teach it to them. They do. I'll be listening to these little boys that y'all think is y'all friends for real. And these literally just be trying to fuck y'all. They don't tell you how men really think about y'all. The shit that y'all be doing, that dumb ass going back to n every single time they fuck you over or always calling these with y'all business and advice, they be cooking y'all behind the scenes. Like I said, a lot of you were raised by side bitches that wanted to be picked. So y'all think the shit that y'all doing is okay. And I bet you if you go in the room right now and look at y'all and mama and see how her life turned out you're gonna listen to what i said and know that i'm right <laughs> yeah because because some listen everybody be acting like in the community they mama is great man you got some sorry good for nothing mamas in the black community yes you do you do you had some there were some side chicks you had some out here with some 304s yeah you had them you, you got them today because you know in in, in the black community you know is this this mama that stuff it's, no uh-uh Everybody mama is not great. Not at all. What she's talking about is actually spot on and why you still have that behavior continuing. Because like my grandfather used to say, old rats make holes, young ones run through them. That's what he used to say about situations like that. How, how the old ones teach the young ones to keep doing the, the exact same thing. And yeah, they don't have any daddy in their life. So yeah, guys, some guys will come along and, 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 and manipulate him and spit game and yeah, they laugh at him. Yeah, she's hundred percent right about that. Actually, the, the ones who don't have a dad around is the ones that actually be more targeted by guys like that because they know if they got a dad around or some sort of father figure around, they're like, oh no, I can't do that with them because they're gonna see me coming. Two thousand percent right. But you know, let me know what y'all think when she said, because yeah, a lot, a lot of these side chicks are raising children. And sometimes these side chicks have two and three kids uh, uh, with somebody else's husband. They do. And they say, well, he's the one in the wrong. He took vows. I agree with you. But that, but that chick, if she knows that's somebody's husband, she knows it ahead of time, and she still lays down with them, she just is wrong too. No, I never excuse a side chick when they know. Now, if they, they didn't know something, they were deceived, and that then trust me, I don't even look at that as a side chick situation. But – if you know that that's somebody's husband, you know that's somebody's boyfriend, and you still do it, and whatever happened to you, I never feel bad for you.